I came out with my first album, there is this powerful man of God that invited me to Kumase. And it's an honor to invite this powerful man of God to usher us into the altar of Jehovah. And I'm telling you, your life will never be the same. And you may be a dawo so. And you may be a wono. And mena mi papa e babe kase. I see God doing it immediately. And I call him papa. I am honored to invite my father. Papa Victor. I say give the Lord a shout. Papa, God bless you. Oh Lord, we know you are the king. Thank you, Jesus. And we lift you high. Oh Lord, we know you are. Somebody has a chronic skin disease, you are being healed right now. In the name of, In Jesus. The name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. I see somebody suffering from hernia. It's mm. been corrected. It's been corrected. You have an eye problem and an ear problem at the same time. Somebody has a cataract in the eye. Jesus. You are being, it's been cleared right now in the in name, the of, name Jesus. of Jesus. Now, in the next minute, what we are going to do is every stronghold is about to be pulled down. In the name of Jesus. Something happened at Jericho. Mm. But I want to put a twist on it tonight. Turn to three people and tell them we are going to put a twist on it tonight. Going to put a twist on it. Now, the twist is they moved around Jericho six times without saying a word. And on the seventh time, they gave a shout. But I want you to understand that we are no longer operating under the tabernacle of Moses. We are operating under the tabernacle of David. Mm. And therefore, we make noise. So, we are going to do seven shouts. The first one is simply to let the world know that there's only one God. My God. So, number one, as we shout hallelujah and make a noise unto the Lord, let the demons... Let every human being within the sound of our voice understand that we have one God. Come on! And the second time the second time is to prove that God confirmed
confirms his word. Once have I heard it said, and I'm twice, surprised that all you. power belongs to God. So right now, we are seeking a confirmation of the miracles we have received tonight. That as you leave this premise, anything that has been declared upon you, anything that you have heard, it is confirmed. The miracle has taken place. The breakthrough is yours. The open door is yours. Anything that pertains unto life and godliness is your portion. By the count of two, lift up your voice and shout hallelujah. One, two. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, receive your miracle. Receive your miracle. It is confirmed. It is confirmed. Outside, inside. Another third time. Everything in this life. That Something life is happening. Is tripartite. Three. The Father the Son, and the Holy Ghost. So ladies and gentlemen, as we are about to give our third shout, understand that God in three persons. Understand that this God who takes counsel with himself, he doesn't need anybody to advise him. When there is something to be done in the heavenlies, he sits down with his Son. He sits down with the Holy Spirit. And he sits down literally with himself and makes a declaration of intent. He said, let us go down and see what they are building at Babel. He said, let us go and do a recreation of that which has been messed up. Anything that has been messed up in your life, there is about to be a renewal and a revival. By the count of three, lift up your voice and shout hallelujah. One, two, three. Come on, come on, lift up your voice. Lift. Four. Four is the number of the ministry of Jesus on earth. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. The face of a man. The face of the lion, the face of the eagle, and the face of the ox. It is the number of Jesus. And that is why the living creatures had four faces. They had four faces because it typified the ministry of Christ Jesus. So right now, as we are going to give our fourth shout, understand that the one who came to minister as a man, the one who is God, the one who came to serve the ox, a servant, and the one who is imperial and royal, he is in charge of your life. Are you ready tonight? By the count of four. One, two, three, four.
So those five colonnades, five doorways at the pool of Bethsaida, he didn't enter to save his soul. He did not enter to bring joy. He did not enter to bring prosperity or peace. He entered to bring somebody healing. Ay, 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 ay. Everybody comes to church for a reason. We all have different reasons. We are here tonight for different reasons. Some need healing. Some need peace in their life. Some need joy. But as you shout the fifth time, the fifth time, grace is coming upon your life in a measure beyond your understanding. By the count of five, one, two, three, four, five. Number six. Six is the number of man. Yes, I. You know what? He's concerned about you. Sometimes we wonder what he thinks about us. Some years ago, as a young man, I lay on the bed of sickness. And literally, I was dying and died. As I lay on that bed that day, I saw my spirit leave my body. And that's the day I knew that there is life after death. And I saw myself weightless, lying on the bed. I'd been suffering seriously from some kind of jaundice. My, my, my urine was not yellow, it was black. And the doctor wondered why I was still alive. And then I saw myself lying there. And then I remembered what I promised God when I was informed too. It was so many years later. And I said to God, I'm not dying today until I do the work of God. I don't know what condition or situation you are in. But you know, when you covenant with God on some level, nobody, no demon, no evil spirit, no principality, no power, no human being can cut you off before your time. And tonight, I want you to understand that God is concerned about you. Even the hairs on your head, he knows. And he numbers it. And you know what? He's about to give you a surprise. Are you ready? By the count of six. One, two, three, four, five, six. tonight as you shout the seventh time understand that there is no turning back there is no prevention there is no stopping there is no impossibility there is no incapability there is nothing that can draw you back from your God given intent and purpose and ladies and gentlemen within the sounding of my voice all is accomplished one two three four Five, six, seven!
there, behind, everywhere. Oh I want God. you to take a seed. I know this is free, but Christians, we like free bees. Take a seed, 100 Ghana, 200 Ghana, 50 Ghana, 10 Ghana. And as we worship for a minute, then I'll start making declarations, put in your offering. I believe in that. And we lift. Put it on the altar. You have. Put it on the altar. And, and pray. Put it on the altar, mommy. Come on, just walk forward, walk forward wherever you are. I and I and I. We haven't closed, we haven't closed. Just bring your offering. Allow people to come forward. Come on. Those of you outside. Throw it on the altar. Put it on the altar outside. I'm coming there. Put your offering there. Of you outside, I'm coming there. Put it on the altar. Allow people to come here. Put it on the altar and pray. Because people want to tap into something. There is fire on the altar. Come and pray. Oh, the two are men, Jack. I need your shirt to be active. Praying God is taking some things off your life. Mr. Wood, the two hundred man, men, check up. My crop of food from Bra. Mr. Uka. Just bring the one forward with your seed. Come forward with your seed. Come forward with your seed. Hey, Yako. Hey, Yako. Hey, Yako. Hey, Yako. My darling, go. Fire. Fire. What the two are men check? Missing Jesus. Awesome. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me take their money and bless you. Go. Let me take their money. Bless you. Go. Bless you. Go. Go. Bless you. Other people want to tap into the fire. Go. Go. Why? Go. Mama, why no more bra? Darling, go. Me patch up your obedience and go. 
go. Go. My God. What's up in Sakata? What your child want? Go. Go. Fire. 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 Take your time. Fire. My God, put it on the altar. In the light of his word, what a glory.
those hands, lift it up. Hold somebody's hand and lift it up. I will start from the spiritual and come to the physical. I pray that spiritual giftings and callings will fall. Mantles. Oh my goodness. Yeah. All over this place. Mantles are falling. Apostolic mantles are falling. Are falling. Apostolic mantles are falling in the name of Jesus. Prophetic mantles are falling. Prophetic mantles are falling now in the name of Jesus. Outside, inside, seven people outside. Seven. If somebody's being dragged to the floor, let them go. Evangelistic mantles are falling all over this place. Pastoral mantles upstairs. Pastoral mantles. Hold somebody and lift up your are falling. Teaching mantles all over the place. May the giftings of the Holy Spirit come alive. Jesus. May the giftings of the Holy Ghost. Come alive. If you are in holding money in your hands, come and touch my hand. Come alive. Come alive. Quick, quick. I see some unique grace coming upon seven people. These people's lives will not be the same. Wherever they stand, they'll start moving forward right now. It's such a mantle that these people shall be known. In this nation and in nations of the world, it is strange unctions to function. In the name of Jesus. Fresh oil. Please take care of that lady. Fresh oil. Let him go if he's going. Let him go. He's Leave coming. him. Don't let anybody drag you. Fresh oil. I see tongues of fire coming upon some heads. On fire. There's somebody with a heart condition. You are being healed now. Your heart. Your heart. Somebody's being healed right now in the name of Jesus. Even as I call forth, it happens immediately. Your neck problem is gone. Ah, somebody has a shorter leg than the other leg. And because of that, you're having severe waist and back pains. That leg is being straightened. Now, in the name of Jesus, as I call it forth, so Jesus does. Somebody is due for a test on their kidneys. The Lord is touching your kidney right now right now you came here to worship believing God for a miracle and you're receiving that miracle oh God shower your blessings upon us I open the heavens for divine encounters and blessings in the name of Jesus as you go forth tonight the blessings of God that make it rich and addeth no sorrow let it be your portion. Let you, yours be the portion among the righteous. No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. Your enemies are under your feet. And by the oil of the spirit, when you get to your workplace, your promotion letter will be there. The one who said amen, receive it now. Ah, you've been looking for the increase in salary. When you get to the office, that letter is there. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Jehovah God. May the victory of the Almighty be your portion. May the victory of the Almighty be your portion. And from tonight, let your course be feathered by God. 
nothing will stop you you are lifted up the Lord is your fortress he is your strong tower and in him we shall trust and therefore we will not fear what can man do to us as you go home tonight you who couldn't sleep you will sleep and you woke up, wake up in the morning because the Lord sustains you I see that contract on your table ready for signing in the mighty name of Jesus I hear the word victory 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 many people the one who clapped their hands receive your victory the one who shouted the door is open Somebody is moving into a new building. You are moving into a new building. Somebody is buying land. Somebody is receiving a gift of a car. In the name of Jesus, mighty things are happening. This is a Holy Ghost meeting. the imposition of the ability and the grace of the spirit upon your life may the Holy Ghost disturb you so much that you will do nothing but to cry unto God because you say your salvation has come insight insight ah, ah, ah. let her go 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 you have no authority and right over her life you will not take her you will not you will not you will not you will not that yoke is broken that link that umbilical cord from her family is broken in the name of jesus leave her never again never again never again never again Lift up your hands and start thanking God. Lift up your voice.